So, I created a list a while back, and I do mean it's been a wee while since I've actually added anything to this list. Now, you're probably wondering, what list am I talking about? Well, you see, I decided that any random idea that I had that popped up and everything else, I kept adding to this list on my phone. And I kept adding to it, and adding to it, and adding to it, to the point where I've only maybe done one or two of these ideas and gone, the rest of them gone like, maybe that could be a cool idea. Uh, that may not be such a great idea to even do at all. So what I've decided to do is, why don't I just do all the ideas? Literally, go through this entire list, almost like a series, and go through this entire list, even if the idea is not so great, or it could be really good, and do it. I mean, why not? Some of these cool ideas I've got. So one of the first ones is on the top, actually on the list. So I'm not going to go in any particular order. I'm just going to pick whatever I want and stuff like that and just go for this one. But I'm going to do them all. I'm going to do them all. And some of them are very strange. But the one that's caught my eye the most that's been making me think quite a bit is having it pretty much roughly goes Mecha Pony Mecha Pony. That's pretty much all it's kind of gave me. So I'm like, well, what does that mean? So. The other put a description I put, I put this a while back, is main sex. So I'm guessing I've got to use the main sex and mecha. But then I most I thought, well, does that mean then mecha zord? So maybe it's taking some inspiration from mecha zord. So I thought that could be a cool video to do. So I'm going to do this entire series. This could be really cool. I'm just gonna go with it. Not sure how this is gonna turn out, not entirely sure, but I what I realized is I'm gonna have to literally build this from scratch because it doesn't exist. There's nothing like this. I mean, there's robotic ponies and there's like Mechazord that the thing that I'm thinking of doesn't exist. So I'm pretty much gonna have to build up from the scratch and figure out where it's gonna go. So uh yeah, I think we should just dive into it and see how we get on. So but I think we're going to have to do some kind of rough idea roughly before I do the main rough sketch. So uh, yeah, let's get to it and uh, let's see what we do. This should be an interesting one. And hopefully this goes well, I don't know, we'll see. But uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, I'm going to quickly go over of what I was pretty much doing. So this is kind of sped up because I wanted to get to the actual point, the actual sketch overall. But this took me a while, I had to really sit down and think what's going to... What am I doing for this? So, the few things that I did was I did some kind of rough idea of what I kind of want some of the parts going to be, like this mega head. Uh, one of the other things was placements of where each character is going to be and where they're going to be and on which bit. I kind of decided the earth point should be the legs, the pegasus should, should be the arms, uh, Red is going to be the body and Twilight is going to be the head because she's kind of like, you know, the princess. Kind of makes sense. Friendship is magic. Um, I also decided that kind of the like the actual proper kind of head, you know when Mechasaur kind of changes and forms, there's a secret head that just pops out of nowhere. The other thing I also decided was make a sword but encrusted with the elements of harmony. Really cool. I also wanted some kind of cannon, so I called it the Rainbow Cannon. I think that'll be really cool. Not sure which design I want to go with, but I decided to draw a few different ones as well. And that is not just all, I also wanted to think, what pose am I going to go with? So, I ended up drawing three poses, and uh, I ended up actually just, you know what, I think I'll probably go with the first one I drew. So, this is just a quick round down, let's get on with it, shall we? Now that we pretty much have the rough sketch finalized, I think this looks pretty cool. So let us jump into doing the line work and then the color. Sometimes it takes a little bit more for villainy to listen to the power of friendship. So the main six decided that if villains were going to learn the power of friendship. That they would need to construct something. Something powerful. Something to show every pony and every creature 
the true power of friendship. What it means to be totally united. So they built something. Something big. Something mecha. This giant mechanized titan has every piece of the main six. For legs, it has the two Earth ponies, Pinkie Pie and Applejack. For the arms, it has Rainbow Dash and Fluttershy. And for an elegant body, it has Rarity. And of course, the one princess, Twilight, is the head, with also her wings, because she's an alicorn. But that is not all that this titan has. It also harnesses the elements of harmony. It has a sword encrusted with each element. And if that is not enough, there is also a cannon that fires concentrated power of rainbows at the enemy. But this isn't just to show that friendship is powerful and can truly reunite people or poets. This will be any creature's reckoning who cross its path but it will also protect every creature that is truly friends with the main six it has honesty kindness Laughter, generosity, loyalty, and magic. This titan. This mechanical being. Will come forth when the main six require it so. Powered by rainbows. Powered by the magic of friendship. It will protect and it will make sure that no one tries to take over the world again. I give you Mechazord Pony. You will feel the power of friendship. Well, there you have it. I don't really have a name for this, I'm going to be honest, but it's pretty much a Mechazord pony. That's pretty much the gist of this piece that I ended up doing, and this actually turned out really well. I'm actually quite happy with the end result of this. But I will say this did take me a little bit of time to kind of decide where I wanted everything to kind of go and everything else. I had a few ideas where I kind of wanted pieces to go, but I'm actually, overall, I'm very happy with this piece and what's really good as well is I'm going to be able to show this at um, the convention I'm going to Griffin Isles which is probably by the time you've seen this video it's probably went and passed so uh, yeah but uh, if you get to see it cool that's awesome you got to see it early before I got a chance to edit this video that's awesome but uh, yeah so um, 
this piece overall, I had a lot of fun with this. This looks amazing. Um, I'm actually really happy this has turned out. Um, at first, I'm going to admit, I wasn't really sure with some parts. Some bits, even with the amount of stuff that I was adding to it and adding to it, I kept going, is this going to work? Is this going to So I just kept adding details to that. But there is a point where you've got to go, okay, I've got it just kind of started. I don't want to get to the point where I ruin it. So, <laughs> But uh, yeah, this actually turned out much, much better than I thought. Honestly, I was, it was such a, it was a, it was an idea that I wanted, but at first when I even think of this idea, I'm like, how am I going to do this? Did I put it in four or that? So I just went, you know what, let's do it in two, but still make it as ponyish as much as possible. So what do you guys think about this? Uh, do you like the piece? Do you like this idea of me going through this bunch of lists of ideas that I've got? Even if some of them could be wacky, weird, maybe some of them will be good, but some of them might be bad. I mean, not everything is going to be a gem at the end of the day. It's always kind of, you got to learn these things. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys look forward to the other ideas that I've got on this list. And I kind of want to tackle this whole list, even if some of the ideas are very weird, very thingy, and it also kind of makes me think of, okay, this is the thing I've got to do, even if it turns out uh, meh, I still want to show you guys to just kind of say, hey, not everything's going to be a bang at the end of the day. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Goodfly. This is Foolish. We'll see you guys next time. And yeah, till then, take care.